All right, so another thing that happens all the time is the screwing up of things, okay? Let's take, for example, that a student is on Maya for a while and has totally screwed up the interface. I mean, to the point of ridiculous concepts. Uh, two things that you could do to actually repair this before we get started. If you go to Window, Settings and Preferences, and go to Preferences, We have something under Edit, Restore Default Settings. Okay? That will restore everything back to normal. That's one way to handle it. Now let's take, for example, that you have totally, totally screwed it up. <laughs> and I've seen this quite a lot. If you're on a Mac operating system, I want to show you something. I'm going to close out of Maya and not save. I'm going to go to the finder window and I'm going to go under my name. I'm going to go under library, preferences, look for Autodesk, Maya 2009, and take this preferences directory and delete it. Or you can rename it if you don't. Let's say if you go to get info, I can go in here and preferences old, for example, if you feel like doing that. You might want to do that if you have some kind of scripts that you have saved out. Now, if I relaunch Maya, what will happen is it will pop up with a thing that says create default preferences. This will totally restore Maya back to factory default. And there we go. So that is restoring Maya back to factory default.